Day six of my helicopter license conversion. As I get more control of flying the helicopter, the goal now is to go through emergency procedures over and over again. So we did more auto rotation emergency engine failures. Along with his supervision in the helicopter, he wanted me to be able to do the entry, descent, and flare all by myself, but that's a lot to take in. So we broke it up to help train my brain from thinking about it mechanically to transition into doing it through muscle memory. We went out to the fields and practiced the entry and descent, not once, but close to 10 times. We would come down and do an overshoot and climb back up and do it all over again. After I got used to the entry and descent, we came back and rested for about two hours. Then we went back out, but this time we went out to do the flare part of the auto rotations. We practiced coming in at 65 knots, and then he showed me how coming in at 75 knots in some unique situations could possibly give us a couple of hundred extra feet to glide. I also like doing this at the airport because it allowed me to practice a lot of takeoffs and circuit work. After doing this about 10 more times, we came back, landed, and now I have another 2.6 hours of flight time under my belt.